Hello, my name is Anthony, and today I'm going to show you how to use the Epson Photo Printer. Let's get started. Okay, so now that we uh, have the introductions out, out of the way, we're going to check some basic printer maintenance. If you are using cut sheet media, make sure that you have at least four or five uh, cut you know, sheets of paper in here. If you are using roll paper, make sure to ask some 3D Lad staff and they will be sure to help you. Okay, to load up the cut sheet media, first things first, you have to take off this blue plate. In order to put the paper in properly, you're going to want to have the blank side uh, facing down when you insert it into the tray. Okay. You know that you've done a good job when you can see the Epson professional paper when it's being loaded. Right there. Epson paper. Okay, now that you have that, simply load it back up. And you've done the cut sheet media. Congratulations. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to find a photo that we like, um, a high res one. So we'll go to, we're going to open up Google Chrome. And we'll type in mm, high resolution city. Hmm? Ooh, this looks pretty. You know what? I like that a lot. I think we'll use this. Okay, view image. Gonna save it. I'm going to open image in a new tab. Looks good. We're gonna save image as. <clears throat> I'll just save it under downloads for this local computer. Okay, looks good. And now what we'll do is we will open up. Photoshop. So photo shop. And we're going to find our file. So open downloads. Our it's gonna be around here somewhere. High resolution city. There it is. Looking good, looking good. Okay, now we're going to go to image, image size, and we're just going to look and make sure everything looks good. I like these settings, I like them a lot, so we're going to press OK. Now we're going to go to Control Print, or Control P, wherever print is. Never mind. Now we're going to just press Print, so Control P. And we're going to come scroll down here to scale to fit sheet media. Mm -hmm. And we have 11 and a half by 16 and a half. And that's, that's the size we want because we're going to use cut sheet media. And we're going to come over here to print settings. And we're going to use premium luster photo paper, 260. We're going to have color. We want it to be good quality. I want max quality because this is this is really nice looking. Um, everything looks good. Our source is the paper tray, and that looks well as well. We have print preview, printable area. We always want that centered so it look really good. And this looks good. Yeah. Go ahead. Press OK, and then we will press print. And then we have to wait a couple seconds for the um, printers to communicate with each other. And I like what I'm seeing with this, you know, all the margins and stuff, so I think that's good. You can pretty much ignore this, this little pop-up, and that's fine. And then press print when you're satisfied. 
And in the back you'll hear the printer start moving. And that is it. Our print job is coming out. All right. Now that your print is done, you can go ahead and take it off and examine your handiwork. My oh my. That looks gorgeous. Take a look. Are you zoomed in on it? Very good. And then zoom out. All right. Well, that completes our tutorial on how to use the Epson Photo Printer. Have a good day.